hello and welcome uh, today we will discuss how to initiate transfer in eo in, uh, in e file uh, 5.6 version over there we have to just simply click uh, on the emd after that we have to go to the transfer module and click on the initiate transfer and search the employee who, to whom we are going to transfer from one department to another department for example, we will uh, uh, search the user by his name or by employee code. Th these are the optional. Just click on the um, <coughs> username. After that, uh, we have to um, select the some of basic information like order date and order number. B based upon that, uh, the employee is going to transfer to going to relieve from the uh, one other uh, single department, and on that basis. Uh, of the office order memo number he will join the another department for that we have to just fill the basic information and select the department from uh, which department employee is going to relieve and two department will be that that um, department with which uh, employee is going to join we have just write down the location and the uh, with the location that means the department name and over there we have to select the respective OU in which the employee, employee is going to join <coughs> we uh, just write down the remarks while we are initiating the transfer remarks are the optional it's not the mandatory and just for uh, the confirmation or the in, in input which we are provided over there and the remarks will be displayed while the transfer uh, transferred employee will join his parent OU or other uh, department just after filling the information click on the initiate and just check out the information in the, under the inbox if we will go through the uh, inbox and click on the edit button the same option will be displayed over there and we will write down our remarks and just click on after that writing the remarks we click on the finalize and relieve that means we are going to relieve the, that employee from our department okay this one is the uh, department uh, to from which the employee is going to relieve and we uh, similarly we have to using the account of the local admin of the other department at which the employee will join by clicking on the <coughs> employee uh, sim in a similar way uh, EMD and after that initiate uh, uh, click on the transferred employee after that we have to select the transferred joining inbox over there we will get the request of the employee having detail we who is going to our join uh, joining our department by just clicking on the designation that means which post the employee will join we have to select and type of appointment over there that means which kind of um, uh, uh, nature of employee is just click click on the joining and confirm over there in the window we will also get the additional information through which the employee is initiated for the transferred just simply we if uh, we accept the request and the uh, over here we will check out the information the employees automatically created uh, we just simply um, based upon the employee name or employee code we will find out or search that employee to whom we have recently provide the access or uh, accept the initiated transferred request from his parent to you we will simply just write down the employee name and after that we will click on the search uh, after clicking the search we will find out that we have to create only his posting over there it is quite similar while we are creating the posting we have just simply select the post name and marking areas and the all of these kinds of the previous activity which we are already following while we are posting the employee uh, we have to select the OU name at which the employee is going to post and we will also select the OU in the marking abbreviation 
just for our confirmation or our standard protocol how we are defining the marking abbreviation we will uh, select over the from date and their other respective detail over there just by clicking on the from date that means the date at which the employee is going to joining primary if OU is acting as if OU head then we also select the OU head after that it, another page will be displayed over where we have to create his reporting officer a post hierarchy that means the upper level of um, that employee which he is recently joined over there we have to select the organization name at which his reporting officer will be has had been posted over there okay just click on the submit button this one is the post hierarchy detail when we create uh, employee posting after that it's the next one step the employee is posted after that we have to provide his respective role of the module and just click on the admin panel and after that AMS and application post role over there we can provide the role to the user if we are on we are using over over here only e file we have to select on the e file after that we will search the post of that employee and employee marking abbreviation will be displayed <coughs> over there we will just select the respective role actually the role is based upon the designation we will provide the role instance sender instance receiver that means the other department uh, have uh, user will get the access to transfer to send his file to the other department if he will select the instance uh, from the drop down or the bundle of list will be displayed in the role based uh, checkbox we have this simply double click on that particular role if we will select that role the employee will automatically get assigned just click on the submit button and over here we will uh, display a message that means role has been assigned this is the simple process if we will uh, follow the um, these steps there is no need to uh, active or deactive the employee uh, digital signature just after providing the role we have to just simply transfer his files or receipt which are pending in his account to the appropriate officer um, in respect to send or forward his pendency of file or receipt which are lying in the particular user we have to select there section and username the from uh, from from checkbox we have to select the employee name to we, of which we are going to transfer is receipt or file and the below part uh, transfer to that means we have to select that employee which we are going to transfer the relieved employee receipt and file okay just simply click on that the transfer button the transfer of receipt and file uh, uh, supported in the Mozilla Firefox we have to select the appropriate uh, office order and after that click on the OK button a successful message will be displayed on our screen first of all uh, we will check the receipt and file after that we will click on the transfer button the selected receipt and file will be transferred to the employee this means a simple process that means the employees employee all the data has been transferred just like that click on the um, just write down your remarks and upload a office order or instruction instruction may be on the email we have to take the print out of that email or office order all the receipt and file has transferred to that employee an office order copy will be attached with that receipt or file this one is a simple process how to transfer 
this one is the easy process over there there is no need to inactive or another reactive or active on this user digital signature this, this one is the time saving process okay anyway thank you if you like the video or please do share with colleague who is uh, using the eops or just sharp screen thanks for watching